Hi guys, welcome to TechBase. In this video, we're going to talk about a new feature that we can encounter in Windows 11 24H2, and that is basically something related to the new Photos app that has received quite a few updates in Windows 11 24H2. These updates are right now available only for Copilot Plus PCs, but will also be available for other devices as well in the near future, most likely in the month of November. So Microsoft released a preview of the super resolution alongside with the OCR support and other productivity focused improvements to the Photos app. So basically, the super resolution uses AI to enhance and enlarge images up to eight times the original image size and also OCR which is optical character recognition which will basically allow you to manage information easier in your images you can detect text also allow you to copy it directly in the clipboard I think that is pretty nice so let's check out the new photos app and see how it works so if you enjoy videos like these please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the tech base channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one so let's begin with the video First of all, I want to give a huge shout out to Phantom of Earth on Twitter for providing images about this new feature because I don't have it yet. I don't have a Copilot Plus PC. So when you open a photo inside the Photos app and then you try to edit it, you're going to notice this new feature at the top, which is called Super Resolution. It also has the AI stamp on it. Basically, when you click on it, you're going to see that it is a really simple feature. You have a scale and it also shows you the current and the new resolution that it can give to the image. You also have, of course, the explanation of how the Super Resolution works and how it can can make low resolution images clearer and more detailed. For example, whenever you are going for the A times scale, you're going to notice that from a resolution of 598 with 514, you can get a resolution up to eight times bigger. I think that is pretty interesting. And whenever you're doing the process, you're also going to notice that the app lets you see the differences between the old and the new resolution generated for the image. From what I've seen before and from other people testing it, the results are not nearly as expected. Maybe you have to have an expectation but the results are decent but not as good as I expected. I think I've used a lot of other third-party apps that do a better job or older apps than the Photos app in Windows 11 but of course I'm thinking that Microsoft is working on developing this and working on improving this after of course a lot of users will test it. One thing about OCR basically the second big feature related to the Photos app that can also detect text written by hand and it supports over 160 languages. I think that is pretty interesting. Microsoft is also adding a few other improvements to the Photos app. For example, they are launching single click support in the gallery. With this update, you can now open individual images with a single click to make navigation more efficient. And of course, double clicking works as before. Also enhancements to the zoom feature now include large images automatically resizing to fit within the viewer window and improved synchronization between the zoom slider and the zoom selection display. And Microsoft is also implementing bug fixes for the image creator and also restyle image features on Copilot Plus PCs to improve overall quality. So basically, as I've said right now, this is only available for Copilot Plus PCs. You need to have the latest version 2024-111-0017-007. And of course, this will also be available for other devices in the month of November. For more information about this feature, you can check out the article below or the official Microsoft blog post and also Phantom of Earth on Twitter for more information about different features in Windows 11 24H2. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave a like below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. This is Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.